Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing my September boxy charm. The one product I got to choose because you get to choose every month was the Glam Glow Youth Mud Glow Stimulating and Exfoliating Treatment Mask. It originally is $60, which I would literally never pay $60 for a face mask. So just stay in that there. Um, it does kind of tingle and burn at first, which they say is supposed to happen. But it has volcanic pumice rock to help smooth the appearance of fine lines and soften your skin. I definitely think it does do that, but this is something I'm going to reuse up and never buy again because $60? No. The next is a Elena Bad Row Baby Blues Set. It's a three piece limited edition synthetic makeup brushes and a travel brush, which is usually $58. Are you kidding me? No. I would never spend $58 on brushes. I'm also kind of annoyed at how many brushes they keep sending me because I wish there was an option where I could like apt out of brushes because I have like two jars worth of brushes. I don't need more brushes. With that being said, they are like nice brushes, but at the same time, they don't feel like anything special. And they're nice, but again, worth $58 never in your life we have a clear brow gel from saint lux beauty i recently like i'm really obsessed with the got to be swarskov styling spiking glue and i ended up buying like a empty mascara tube and i attempted to put it in there and then they ended up releasing an eyebrow gel which i was like of course but i really like this one because it kind of has that same formula of the hair gel and it's very like stiff but not like crusty and I really like it. It's definitely something, again, wouldn't rebuy because it's $22 but it, I'm glad I have it. And it's very small and it's so very travel friendly. Next up I have the Real Her Moisturizing Lipstick which usually is $18 and I have the color I define beauty myself and it's a cute like nudie pink so what I wear like 24 7 most of the time <laughs> I don't stride away from a lot of colors which I need to get better at because I do love lipstick and I have like a billion definitely more pink than I like I mean, she looks cute, but she's making my teeth look like corn. And my teeth usually don't look yellow. So she's definitely gonna need like, like a brown lip liner for me to like this. Next up we have the Georgette Clinger Marula Primer. It's for all skin types. And this usually runs $32. It's supposed to blur in perfection and ensure all day radiant finish. And that it's long wearing. But I wouldn't say it's more moisturizing. It's not it's not gonna blur your skin. Looks the same. Feels moisturized and tacky. But not in a bad way. Kinda like powdery. It's nothing special but I'll use it. Total ends up being $190, which for the $25 fee that it costs me, probably more like 26 with tax, that's a really good deal. But if I'm going to rate it out of five, I'm going to rate it like two and a half out of five, just because like I didn't need more brushes the primer was okay nothing to write home about so i'm really only really love the lipstick and the eyebrow gel and the mask is nice but maybe i'll give it a three i'll be generous it's a three hope you enjoyed this video and give it a thumbs up and a like and a share and subscribe and have a good day bye